Today's question comes from one of our entrepreneurial customers who is developing their own product and they need a magnet that is not quite the size that we have in stock. So what they want to know is, can I take the magnet and cut and grind it and alter it to the shape that I need to alter it to? Well, the answer is yes, you can cut and grind. However, there are some factors that you should consider when you're cutting and grinding a magnet, especially in this situation, a neodymium magnet. Neodymium magnets by nature are very brittle, so they will want to chip, they will want to break. So it's, it's very important that if you cut or drill a magnet, you use a diamond tip drill or you use diamond tip wheels. This will grind away the piece of the magnet that you want. And as long as you do it slowly, it should not chip too much. So just remember diamond tips and go very slowly. Um, the second consideration that you should take is that grinding and drilling causes heat. So you want to be very careful not to heat the magnet up too much because then that potentially could demagnetize the magnet. Uh, the next thing you want to do is you want to make sure that the magnet itself, when you cut it and grind it away, if it's magnetized, it becomes extremely messy. So you want to, you want to take uh, breaks every, every now and then as you're cutting and grinding and you want to get rid of that extra slurry that's on the magnet that's attracting to it again because it's magnetized. Or if you don't have any slurry, you just have chips and bits, you want to be able to get them off. So use tape and just, just pat that and it should come right off. Uh, finally, when you cut and grind a magnet, it's going to leave the magnet exposed because you're cutting and grinding away the coating that's on the magnet. So our suggestion is immediately after you're finished to take the magnet and spray it with something that will in inhibit it from rust or, or corrosion. And the two things that we recommend most are something like WD-40, which is very good for that, or a Rust-Oleum product. So good luck. Uh, thanks, thanks for the question. And if you have questions, please send them to info at smagnetics.com or log on to our website at www.smagnetics.com. Thanks.